read to us. We have here transfer of membership. And may I request her to read to us the names of our brothers and sisters who would like to have their membership transferred. Afterwards, we are very happy to tell you, once again, we have candidates for baptism. And she will also be reading their names so that we can accept them uh, subject to their baptism today. Thank you, Pastor. Good morning. This is the first reading for the request of transfer of church membership. From other church to Philippine International Church, the following are Jeremy Rod Cabanez, Leonie Hilda Cabanez, Rodolfo Cabanez. They are from Balayan Day Church, Balayan, Batangas. Ian Nair Cervantes from Tabaco Day Church, Tabaco, Albay. Onesto Encapas from San Jose Day Church, San Jose Occidental, Mindoro. Chino Rafael Lagahino III from Matnog Day Church, Matnog, Sorsogon. We have three from the Mabituin family, Abigail, Clarito, Dulce, Veronica, Mabituin, coming from Dasmariñas, is Day Church, Dasmariñas, Cavite. Dian Solimen, from Pagasa is Day Church, Sablayan, Occidental, Mindoro. Jonalene Zabat, from Gapan is Day Church, Gapan, Nueva Ecija. And the last, we have Brother Rigel Guard Zamora, from Nagilian is Day Church, Nagilian Isabella. From Philippine International Church to other churches, we have Kenneth Durante, from Kamheng International Day Church, Bangkok, Thailand. Charlotte Jeremy Fajardo, to Mamsis Day Church, Pasay City, and Zina Iraq, to Albuquerque Three Angels Day Church, New Mexico. Okay, the next one are the candidates for baptism. We have five candidates. As I read your name, please come up. Marian Ferry. Marian Ferry. Jason Guzago. Andrew Ocampo. And Rafaela Franzin Rallos. Mr. Chair, I move to accept these brethren to Philippine International Church membership subject to their baptism this morning. Thank you very much. This is through the effort of some of our brothers and sisters here in coordination with uh, Pastor Jemuel Absede. And now Jemuel, Pastor Jemuel Absede himself will be the officiating minister. So it has been moved that we accept them into church membership. Is there a second to that motion from our church members? Thank you very much. All in favor that we now accept them into church membership, please raise your hand. Thank you very much. And those opposed may do the same. So it's carried. We will now proceed immediately to our baptism. And Pastor Absede will be our officiating minister.
to request everyone to please pause for a moment. Let us pray. Our loving God, Heavenly Father, the author of life and the author of salvation, we give honor and praise to your name for this wonderful time, this very significant day that you have entrusted to us where we can have this baptism. Father God, we entrust our lives unto you in a special way for these five candidates. Thank you for your grace, which is sufficient to all our weaknesses. And thank you for the forgiveness of our sins through the blood of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Now, we commit our lives unto you as we proceed to this baptism. May the Holy Spirit be with us and bless us today. This I ask in the loving name of Jesus. Amen. second second birthday in the Lord that you will be baptized today because of your love to, to him that you accept him as your personal Savior and Lord and you're willing to obey his will and now because of your decision I as the minister of the gospel I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit Amen happy for you and even the angelic host in heaven because of your decision to accept him as your personal Savior and Lord and to follow his will in your life on your journey and because of this I as the minister of the gospel I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit of your love to Jesus Christ you heard the word of God and uh, you accept the truth that in Jesus Christ you have salvation and uh, because of your decision to follow him that you will obey his will being a young people you're willing to uh, uh, sacrifice yourself because Jesus Christ was the one who sacrificed for you on the cross of Calvary. And because of that, I as the minister of the gospel, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. accept it and uh, you're willing to uh, commit your life to the Lord as your Savior and Lord and uh, you're decided to uh, 
turn away from this world and you will follow Jesus Christ in your life. And because of this, I, as the minister of the gospel, I baptize you in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Andrew, it's a long time since you came here in AUP, and now finally you will accept Jesus Christ as your personal Savior and Lord, because you understand the truth from the previous belief, a belief that you have, and because Jesus Christ is the one who touched your life, and you're willing to accept him as your personal Savior and Lord, and you will follow his will from now on. I, as the minister of the gospel, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Shall we pray? Our loving God, Heavenly Father, we are so happy today. Here are your people, the big family of yours. We're glad to have these five special individuals who accept you as their personal Savior and Lord. And now, O oh Lord, we commit them to you. From now on, they received you fully in their hearts and they decided to follow your will. While they, were, they are waiting for thy soon coming, O oh Lord, I pray that your Holy Spirit will always be with them to help them, to give courage, to be faithful into your uh, will and to be faithful following the footsteps of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ help them to be an overcomer through your grace which is sufficient to all our weaknesses and help them O Lord to be faithful until you come in the clouds of glory and while we are waiting please help them and give them the chance to get involved in sharing the gospel to other people. And also, all of us who are here, who witnessed for these five individuals to accept Jesus Christ as their personal Savior and Lord today, may we find joy, peace, and comfort, and also the challenge to share the gospel wherever we go. Thank you so much for accepting our commitment today. Thank you for hearing and answering our prayers. This I ask in the loving name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen.